Penelope Cruz. Born. April 28, 1974, Alcabendas, Madrid, Spain. Birth name. Penelope Cruz Sanchez. Nickname. P. Height. 5 foot 4 1 fourth inch, 1.63 m. Known outside her native country as the Spanish Enchantress, Penelope Cruz Sanchez was born in Madrid to Eduardo Cruz, a retailer, and Encarna Sanchez, a hairdresser. As a toddler, she was already a compulsive performer, reenacting TV commercials for her family's amusement, but she decided to focus her energies on dance. After studying classical ballet for nine years at Spain's National Conservatory, she continued her training under a series of prominent dancers. At 15, however, she heeded her true calling when she bested more than 300 other girls at a talent agency audition. The resulting contract landed her several roles, in Spanish TV shows and music videos, which in turn paved the way for a career on the big screen. Cruz made her movie debut in El Labrinto Griego, 1993, The Greek Labyrinth, then appeared briefly in the Timothy Dalton thriller Framed, 1992. Her third film was the Oscar-winning Belle Epoque. 1992, in which she played one of her sisters vying for the love of a handsome army deserter. The film also garnered several Goyas, the Spanish equivalent of the Academy Awards. Her resume continued to grow by three or four films each year, and soon Cruz was a leading lady of Spanish cinema. Live Flesh, 1997, Live Flesh, offered her the chance to work with renowned Spanish director Pedro Almodovar, who would later be her ticket to international fame, and the same year, she was the lead actress in the thriller, drama, mystery, C5 film Open Your Eyes, 1997, a huge hit in Spain that earned eight Goyas, though none for Cruz. Her luck finally changed in 1998, when the movie industry comedy The Girl of Your Dreams, 1998, won her a Best Actress Goya. Cruz made a few more forays into English language film, but her first big international hit was Almodovar's All About My Mother, 1999 in which she played an unchaste but well-meaning nun. As the film was showered with awards and accolades, Cruz suddenly found herself in demand on both sides of the Atlantic. Her next big project was Woman on Top, 2000, an American comedy, about a chef with bewitching culinary skills, and a severe case of motion sickness. While in the U.S., she also signed up to star opposite Johnny Depp in the drug trafficking drama Blow, 2001, and opposite Matt Damon in Billy Bob Thornton's All the Pretty Horses, 2000. Cruz says she's wary of being typecast as a beautiful young damsel, but it's hard to imagine disguising her wide-eyed charms and generous nature. Fortunately, with Cameron Crowe's Vanilla Sky, 2001, a remake of Open Your Eyes, 1997, and a John Madden collaboration looming in her future, damsel Penelope isn't likely to disappear just yet. Family. Spouse. Javier Bardem. July 2010. Present. Two children. Children. Luna Ensenas Cruz. Leo Ensenas Cruz. Parents. Eduardo Cruz. Encarna Sanchez. Relatives. Monica Cruz. Sibling. Eduardo Cruz. Sibling. Trademarks. Long dark brown hair. Seductive deep voice. Spanish accent. Trivia. Her sister, Monica Cruz, was used as her body double during the filming of Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, 2011 on account of her pregnancy, speaks three languages, Spanish, Italian and English. Despite common misconception, she can't speak French. She hired a dialect coach to help her in the French film Fan Fan, 2003, and learned her lines phonetically. She also needs the help of a translator when she is promoting a film on French television. Second Spanish performer to win an Oscar for acting. The first was Javier Bardem. Married long-term partner Javier Bardem at a friend's house in the Bahamas in a small ceremony with just family members present. Was seven months pregnant with her son Leo when she completed filming on Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, 2011. Has been in a relationship with Javier Bardem since they began filming Vicky Cristina Barcelona, 2008, together in July 2007. Learned Italian because she wanted her role in the movie Don't Move, 2004, really badly. This paid off and she went on to win the Italian equivalent of the Oscars for Best Actress. She was awarded a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame at 6,834 Hollywood Boulevard in Hollywood, California on April 1, 2011. She was awarded by Rob Marshall, 
accompanied by her husband Javier Bardem, and her Pirates of the Caribbean, on Stranger Tides, 2011, co-star Johnny Depp, second Spanish performer to be Oscar nominated. The first one was Javier Bardem, best friends with actresses Goya Toledo and Salma Hayek, good friends with ex-boyfriend Tom Cruise. She was one of the first people to visit his newborn baby daughter Suri. After filming All the Pretty Horses, 2000, she became a vegetarian. She claims her role in Bigus Luna's Jamin, Jamin, 1992, psychologically scarred her for life. She was a teenager when she was cast in the film which required her to do nudity and sex scenes. Likes to keep stray cats. Greatly admires Johnny Depp. She worked with him on Blow, 2001, Pirates of the Caribbean, on Stranger Tides, 2011, and Murder on the Orient Express, 2017. Gave birth to her first child at age 36. A son Leonardo Encinas Cruz on January 22, 2011. Child's father is her husband, Javier Bardem. Two of her ex-boyfriends have been named Sexiest Man Alive by People magazine, Tom Cruise, in 1990, and Matthew McConaughey, in 2005. Was originally cast as Justine in Melancholia, 2011, but dropped out before filming began in order to pursue Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, 2011. As a result, Kirsten Dunst was cast instead. In 2006, she was earning $2 million per year representing Oreo Cosmetics is a huge fan of Indian cinema and has expressed interest in working with Bollywood actor Shah Rukh Khan someday. Gave birth to her second child at age 39, a daughter Luna Encinas Cruz on July 22, 2013. Child's father is her husband, Javier Bardem. Was in a relationship with Matt Damon, June-December 2000. She was named after the song, Penelope, by Joan Manuel Srat, was accompanied by Matthew McConaughey to the Grammy Awards in 2005. The couple met on the set of Sahara, 2005. She founded a non-government organization, GO, called Sabera Foundation. Together with Nacho Cano and other Spanish entertainers, they have set up a home, a school and a clinic for homeless girls and people suffering from tuberculosis in Calcutta. Two documentary programs were made for Spanish TV on this project. Unfortunately, Differences of opinion caused a collapse in the project, and Sabera Foundation tragically no longer exists. Was in a relationship with Tom Cruise, July 2001 January 2004. Her role model is Academy Award winner Meryl Streep. She is the only actress who has won acting awards from the five main European film academies three Goyas, the Spanish, Oscar, one David Di Donatello, the Italian, Oscar, one BAFTA, the British, Oscar, one Caesar, the French, Oscar, and to Felix, the European, Oscar, as well as from the USA Motion Picture Academy, one, Oscar. She spoke Italian in the film Per Amor, Solo Per Amor, 1993, then again in the film Allegrima Non Troppo, 1994. Met Javier Bardem for the first time on the set of Jamin, Jamin, 1992, but they wouldn't become a couple until working together in Vicky Cristina Barcelona. 2008. They also worked together on Live Flesh, 1997, but didn't share any on screen time. She is the only person to win an acting Oscar, Vicky Cristina Barcelona, 2008, and appear in two Oscar winning best foreign language films, All About My Mother, 1999, and Bella Puck. Was the 133rd actress to receive an Academy Award? She won the Best Supporting Actress Oscar for Vicky Cristina Barcelona, 2008 at the 81st Annual Academy Awards, 2009, on February the 22nd, 2009. Quotes, I'm strong and opinionated. Those qualities brought me a lot of problems, since I was a little girl in school. Saying, I don't agree, and fighting with the children. It's part of my curiosity for life. There's so much more I want to do. I refuse to get to 50 and wait at home for the phone to ring. In Spain, actresses work until they are old. That's my plan. I love Salma Hayek. We've been friends for a really long time. I admire how she has come such a long way and always remain grounded in who she is. She never compromises to follow her vision, and she is loyal. Such qualities only mark the great stars. I love the Italian culture. It's a beautiful culture. I love the language, the Italian people, their music, their attitudes. I just love it. Sometimes, I think I'm an Italian trapped in a Spanish woman's body. You cannot live your life looking at yourself from someone else's point of view. On acting, in terms of the work, it always seems like it's a first date. I mean, every time I go to the movie set and start a project, I feel the same feeling, the butterflies in the stomach, 
not having control over it, because acting is like that. That's the beauty of it. You can always keep learning. There's always more. I came to Los Angeles for the first time in 1994. I spoke no English. I only knew how to say to sentences, how are you, and, I want to work with Johnny Depp. My first audition was for the woman who became my manager, and still works with me. She was testing around 300 actors. I was 14 years old, and she had me read a scene from Casablanca, 1942, which is impossible to do when you are that age. But my manager asked me if I wanted to work with her, and she sent me on some castings. When I was 16, I got Jamin, Jamin, 1992. Of course, I had to lie about my age, and I had to lie to my parents about the content of the script. On Johnny Depp, when I first came to America I only knew two phrases in English. One was, how are you, and the other was, I want to work with Johnny Depp. Then after I worked with him, on Blow, 2001, I learned how to say, I want to work with Johnny Depp again. Thank you for your friendship, your talent. You are such an inspiration to us all. The discipline that ballet requires is obsessive, and only the ones who dedicate their whole lives are able to make it. Your toenails fall off and you peel them away, and then you're asked to dance again and keep smiling. I wanted to become a professional ballet dancer. I came to New York to study ballet and English. From her Oscar acceptance speech for Vicky Cristina Barcelona, 2008, thank you so much to the Academy. I wanted to share this with my fellow nominees, and with the amazing ensemble of actors, that I had the privilege to work with in this movie. Thank you, Woody, for trusting me with this beautiful character. Thank you for having written over all these years some of the greatest characters for women. And I cannot talk about great female characters, without thanking my friend, Pedro Almodovar, for having made me part of so many of his adventures. Salaries. The Brothers Grimsby, 2016, $400,000. Sahara. 2005, $1,600,000. Vanilla Sky, 2001, $2,000,000.